Well, they're already starting to melt. The earth will flood. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so much pressure. Um, we wouldn't have a lot of ice in the world. Buy a boat, grow kiwis like uh, like Waterworld. It'd be pretty awesome. I don't know. Move inland. A lot of bad stuff. Since they're floating, the sea levels wouldn't change, but uh, some other things might change. Um, if the polar ice caps melted, wouldn't the ocean, like, no. I don't know. I don't know. I'm an art major. <laughs> well, I would think it's devastating. <laughs> the whole world would flood. No. Um, oh, that's a tough one. The, the ocean levels would rise and, and all the major cities on the coast would get flooded. Yeah, it'd be bad. Uh, I think the okay. The funny answer is the polar bear didn't have didn't have the place to live. <laughs> uh, sea levels would rise, I think, by four feet. Is that right? If the polar ice caps were to melt, you would definitely notice a difference. And there's three pieces of property for us to talk about. First, there's the North Pole. The North Pole is really just a gigantic ice cube floating on the surface of the water. If it were to melt, nothing would really happen. Think about an ice cube in a drink. When it melts, the level of the drink doesn't rise at all. Then there's the South Pole. Here you have thousands of feet of ice up on top of a piece of land. If it were to melt, that would raise ocean levels about 200 feet higher than they are today. And then there's Greenland. If Greenland were to melt, it's the same situation we have at the South Pole, land covered by ice, that would raise ocean levels about 20 feet. Now that would have a huge impact on every coastal city.